everybody. So today I really wanted to talk about something different. Um, you know, I've been in the fall mood just like everybody else, but I wanted to take a break from the fall scents for a little while and just talk about something that I'm enthusiastic about. And if you know me, then you know that I like weird scents that, you know, aren't very typical. Um, you know, scents like <laughs> like leather, <laughs> just like novelty sort of scents that you wouldn't see everywhere. Um, and that's why I wanted to talk to you about some of the bubblegum scents that I have. Um, actually, these are the only two that I currently have. Um, and I love them. Um, they smell to me very nostalgic and they bring me back to like, um, growing up and, and those, those big, um, like quarter gum machines that you would see in like the eighties and nineties and like pizza parlors and stuff. So, um, that had like, you know, chiclets and gumballs and things like that in them. So the first candle here is Mama Llama, which is a brand that I discovered last year and I purchased three candles from them. This one, cotton candy and leather, <laughs> three of the odd bowl scents that I could find on there. Um, and then the other one is my Candles by Chrissy um, candle that I purchased last fall. It was one of the first candles that I ever bought from her. And uh, I was looking for cotton candy and bubblegum scents at the time. So I really um, liked that she had both of those in her store. So I, I ordered them. Um, she's an Etsy seller. So... Um, and I, I found out about her from a candle group that I used to be a part of uh, on Facebook when I was on Facebook. <laughs> I am not anymore, though. So, um, Mama Llama candle, I had already, I've, I've already burned through my cotton candy one, which doesn't smell anything like cotton candy. Um, it was very fruity and sort of their take on cotton candy, but it was not cotton candy. Um... Chrissy definitely gets cotton candy down. Uh, she she knows she knows what it's about. Um, and I have two versions of her cotton candies, actually. So um, Mama Llama candle the the candle that I have already burned through the cotton candy that I had uh, produced a lot of soot, um, and it was just like a black jar all the time. This one. Uh, I've had, I've burned this before, so this isn't my first burn on this candle, and I did, ha I did have to wipe up the soot. So the wicks on this candle aren't, on the, it, that they use in the, this brand, I should say, um, isn't, they, they're not the best. They, they, they call them patented knitted wicks, um, so, you know, but, uh, the Mama, Mama Llama candle, Ooh, that's a tongue twister, is a 14.5 ounce candle with a flat lid um, and with a pink colored wax. I wasn't able to find out if this is, a, what kind of blend this is, if it's a blend um, or not. And yeah, so their description also isn't like, you know, it doesn't have notes or anything like that. But if you can, if you know what a gumball tastes like or you know, whatever, you'll, you'll understand that this is a very traditional bubblegum scent. Now, I do believe that the set, the, uh, fragrance oils that these two companies used are very similar, if not the same. However, one has just used more scent oils than the other. <laughs> and that's really the difference here. Um, I feel like Mama Llama's more of, um, it's lacking that, true bubblegum note that Candles by Chrissy got down. Um, 
I think that it's just a weaker candle though. And had it had more fragrance oil, then it would have hit that, that note that's missing. So these both smell like those traditional chiclets gumballs um, that you got as a kid. Um, any kind of traditional like double bubble, bubble gum, um, you know, bubblicious, obviously. Um, candle by, Candles by Chrissy calls hers bubblicious. Um, Mama Llama is still available in their on their online store, but candle candles by Chrissy, I couldn't see um, that she had any of them listed uh, anymore in, in all the various formats that she usually sells her her um, her wax in. Bubblicious isn't listed, so I I'm not sure if she uh, makes it any longer. But you can always send her a, me a message on there, and she does do custom orders, and she's really um, a wonder to, wonderful person to talk to. Uh, she's a, a very very nice woman. So um, these two these two candles the. The thing, the thing about this is I burn them both separately and at separate times. And the, I do enjoy both of them. I just prefer Candles by Chrissy. Not only because it's stronger, but because her candles burn clean. There's really, I don't really get any soot. And on the Mama Llama, I get soot and it's weaker in in scent. So I liked the idea of pairing them together and doing a quick little comparison and review on both of them. Um, I just really wanted to smell this today. Um, possibly because we're getting to that time of the year where candy becomes more of a focal point because of Halloween and everything. So, um, you know, smelling bubble gum and, and stuff like that is traditional to the Halloween time. And I, I remember it. So, um, I don't know if you guys grew up with, um, eating, um, chiclets, but if you ever g were, an eight, if you were an 80s child, late 80s, 90s, you remember these candy dispensers that were sort of piled on top of each other. They, they were all connected and they were squared. Um, and each each one, like the bottom row would have all of the candy, like runts and gumballs and um, M&Ms and things like that. And then the top row would have all those like plastic balls that had like little toys inside. Um, or you could like slide in, uh, a quarter and get stickers or something like that. So I'll, I'll insert a picture. So yeah, um, those were, those were very big in my childhood. And my father worked at a, um, he was the head chef of a, of a Greek and Italian restaurant that I used to go to on the weekends with my mom, like. I remember going there on Saturdays and I was like four or five years old and I remember going to the front of the store and Nick the pizza guy used to give me a quarter and a, and one of the paper cups and I used to go over to the chiclet machine and I would put my quarter in and I would turn it and then I would put my little paper cup at the bottom and open up the metal lid and then they would all pour in. And that was my little, my little treat. And I, I remember that because it was one of my favorite things that happened at the restaurant. <laughs> it was something that I looked forward to. So this smells like those. To me, this, this is more uh, along the lines of what chiclets and gumballs smell like. Um, it's so true to the scent. I'm I'm just basking in it right now because these are beautiful candles. If you like things like this, get it. I mean, it's so much fun and it's so different to the typical scents that we usually see out there being sold by candle companies. I think if more candle companies were to um, 
have more of a of, of of a selection and be bold and diverse and come out with weird stuff that they would do better i would be more inclined to purchase from a company that has sense like this so anyway i i just wanted to bring you guys something different these are the two bubblegum scents that i have bubblicious by candles by chrissy and bubblegum by mama llama i definitely don't want to i'm not trying to slam any anybody's companies here but i haven't had the best experience with mama llama and um i i wish that i could say that i have because i i'm not interested in um you know talking negatively about anybody or anybody's business but i didn't have the best experience it, it took them a very long time to send me my candles i mean there were a, there were a couple of issues however with bubblicious um by candles by chrissy and my experience with chrissy's candles i have had such a good experience with her candles and um her her she uses a pure um, soy white wax like she doesn't color her wax um, and she puts more scent oils in her candles and her wax melts and everything than um, the standard mass-produced candle companies um, they you know they kind of slack especially nowadays Yankee Candle has really slacked when it comes to fragrance oils um, they don't they don't put enough in as far as I'm concerned. And that's how my experience has been. That's why I like Candles by Chrissy because I know that I'm going to get the strength that I'm looking for. And I've burned probably close to 50 of her. I've, I've experienced at least 50 of her fragrances so far. Um, and she has a wonderful shop. So I'll link her um, shop in the description and I will link Mama Llama in the description so you guys can check them out um, at your leisure. And yeah, so this has been my bubblegum uh, comparison and review. I hope you are all having a wonderful day and I will speak to you soon. Bye! Please like and subscribe and leave me a comment so we can chat.